Hi, I'm Fatima, developer advocate at GitLab. In today's demo, I'll show you how GitLab Premium with Duo helps teams ship better code faster. GitLab Premium with Duo embeds AI directly into your workflow, so you can always stay in the zone. In our Flask-based weather app, we're adding a new feature, a regional visualization map. Instead of searching one city at a time, our users will be able to see conditions across an entire area. Since we're using GitLab, I can see that this issue I'm assigned to is part of a larger epic. In the epic, I can see related work across research, QA, and development, and who's working on what. Let's jump back into our implementation issue. Before I can start writing the code for this, I want to understand how our current API works. First, I ask Duo to explain how our weather data is structured. Then, I'll follow up to see if we already have the geographic coordinates we'd need for a visualization. Duo gives me a clear breakdown without me needing to read through the entire backend. It turns out we already have the coordinates in our existing response. We just weren't using them. I asked Duo to refactor our getWeather function to include those geo coordinates that we need. It generates some code that I can insert right into my file and then review. We can see in the refactored code that Duo updated our function to pull the lat and long from the API response. After reviewing the changes and confirming that everything works as expected, I'm ready to commit and push these backend updates. Oh, it looks like I forgot to create a new branch for my feature. My team's branch protection rules on GitLab block us from pushing the main directly. I'll have to switch to a feature branch for my code. With our backend ready, let's start working on the front end. I need to build a new component, map.js, and wire it into the rest of my application. That means updating our JavaScript, creating the mapbox map, adding the data layers, adding styles, and modifying index.html to support the new layout for our visualization. Duo's inline code suggestions help me build all of these pieces step by step. I'm almost done with this feature implementation. I've packaged Mapbox locally and published it to my project's package registry so that my team can have consistent access to a reliable version of this dependency. Let me check that our CI pipeline is properly publishing the package. Let's verify that it exists in the registry. Okay, now that we've written all of our code, we have to write some tests, which is never my favorite part. Let's ask Duo to generate some tests for our Map.js component. Duo will analyze our implementation and create some tests for multiple scenarios. I can copy these tests, create a new test file, and drop them in to review and add to. And finally, here's our completed feature. Users can now visualize weather patterns geographically, seeing the trends across their regions at a glance. With our implementation and tests ready, it's time to create a merge request. On this merge request, we can see that there are approval rules. Projects can have multiple approval rules to match the complexity of their code base and compliance needs. I'll add a note that while the code is ready for review, we should follow up with the design team to enhance the visual UI for our next iteration. From issue to working merge requests, we used GitLab Premium with Duo to ship all of that code.